names normalization ha has a lot of different use cases for e-discovery and investigations. One use case that frequently comes up is working with privilege logs and the ability to identify one identity name for an attorney or a lawyer who has multiple email addresses. We want to always represent that name the same way and that it's the same individual who's giving that privileged advice. So that's helpful um, when working, when creating and then reporting on your privilege log. It's also really helpful when working with social network analysis. And in fact, we've incorporated the ability to view uh, using the identity feature in our social network analysis. So if I'm looking at a lot of different people, those networks can get quite tangled, right? Everybody emails so often. I can start with that identity view. And then once I'm now, I've dug in and found those um, emails of focus, I can then drill in and open up and see the individual aliases. Oh, it's going to that person's personal address or, or something like that. So we, we have different ways to navigate using uh, the identity option that names normalization offers.